Hey everybody, this is Joe, and here's what I want you to know. I have a Q3, and I set it up in studio on a tripod with flash trigger, and I did some selfies at a pretty decent distance away so I would not be distorted, um, stretched and pulled. Lord knows I'm distorted enough and I don't really need any more. So I set it up at a distance away and I wanted to crop it. I wanted to see if I had to use the camera in studio for a portrait, which I don't have to. I have a Nikon Z9 and I have a Leica SL2. So I don't have to use that, but I really enjoy using the Q3. It's a great, great camera. I just enjoy it. The color palette on it is phenomenal and it's just a great, great piece of equipment. So I set it up and I did it that way, put it on self timer. And I just took some dramatically lit pictures just to see what I do that for people mostly no. it's just more of a head and shoulder shot if I'm doing it in studio but um, I was wanting to show you how well this come out now I cropped it horizontally in the frame I did a horizontal shot and then I cropped them vertical as I would do a portrait and unfortunately you can't get that in the um, computer or the monitor but I am going to fill the frame up and you'll get a really good idea of how that looks cropped from a uh, 5x7 at 300 dpi, 8x10, 300 dpi, and 11x14 dpi. The 5x7 is, I say, really very, very, very acceptable. Um, the 8x10 is still, in my opinion, very usable. The 11x14, it's on that verge, and I don't know that I would do more than that I would say I would be able to uh, hand somebody a nice portrait 11 by 14 and they would think it was really good I mean I'm not just saying that but I would not go in my personal opinion I would not go anything higher than that cropping in as much as I did now if that was a full frame I, 40 by 60 easily um, the, the, it, the sharpness on those lenses and the, the uh, clarity at 60 megapixel is phenomenal. So I guess I answered my own question, but I'd like to know what you guys think. I really enjoy the Q3. It's great for environmental shots, uh, on location, doing some really cool stuff. Even for video, it really does a nice job at video. But I really enjoy uh, using it, and I wanted to see if I could pull it off in the studio. And I really do think I can. I'm not going to unless it's a necessity and all my equipment is not here. But let me know what you think, your thoughts on it. I would like to hear. And thanks for tuning in, and I will talk to you soon. Keep shooting. Bye.